I am so bored. Rawr. You're bored? I'll show you now. He's bored. <laughs> Left. Are you not scared? No. Ooh, I see you're absolutely bored. Let's go find some fun in Jurassic World. Yeah. We'll go there using Zen teleportation. It's a Kyanzasaurus, a relative of a Tyrannosaurus, by the way. It's a little smaller and his snout is stretched. And some scientists believe that he was covered with feathers or fur. Lev, don't hold out your hand. He can eat it. This is one long, even though it's small but carnivorous. Watch your hands, Lev. Oh, and these are called Parasaurolophus. There is a whole family of them here. They are herbivores. Do you see crests on their heads? They use them to make sounds like a trombone. This is how males challenge their rivals to a fight. Lev, where have you climbed? A dinosaur is not a toy. seem to like it. We've come to Ceratop City. These are true hellboys among dinosaurs. Each of their kind has horns and such bone neck shield. It helped them to fight off the predators. Because these dinosaurs lived in herds and were herbivores. Are you scared? And this is Demetrodon. Wave at him. You see a sail on his spine. It serves him as a thermostat. Oh yeah, now that's power. A true carnivorous giant. They don't call him Giganotosaurus for nothing. Although his relative Spinosaurus is even larger. Speaking of, look who is here. This is one of the most ferocious predators. All the dinosaurs feared him. <laughs> With that mouth, I would eat a whole pot of jam. This is Pterodaustra. He had some peculiar brushes with which he filtered plankton. In fact, Pterodaustra is of the pterodactyls genus. These are the flying lizards. There are numerous remarkable species among them. For example, Quetzalcoatl. It is the largest of all the flying creatures in the history of the planet. Its wingspan was up to 35 feet. Lab, I told you, don't reach your hands to predators. Careful, there is a mega raptor in front of you. It's famous for its sickle shaped claws on the forelimbs. And the one you mock is Velociraptor. He is a true Hollywood star. He appeared in movies about Jurassic Park. Whoa! And these are dinosaurs' eggs. Small dinosaurs hatch from them. Can you believe that such enormous creatures came from such small eggs? Well, Lev, time for us to go. Let's enter our egg teleporter and go home. Wow! What an adventure! Thank you so much, dinosaur! It was very cool! You're welcome, lad.